Hello everybody, it's Emmy Mox, and here we are on a nice Wednesday afternoon. I am going through some rough times right now. Uh, so Twitch is not my day job. I I work as a I worked I should say as a a, a retail associate whose job was to collect items throughout the store we were in and then bring them out to customers at a curbside pickup. Uh, and it's it's been a rocky relationship between me and the job for a while, but at the end of the day they'd always given me a professional courtesy when it came to things. As of this month, I've pretty much taken the entire month off as vacation time because I could. I, I had the time, I wanted to get away from the job because of how stressful it was. And I took the time off. I, I went through the proper channels. I did everything I was supposed to. But as of this week, the my employer has chosen to not pay me. I'm not getting paid this week. I don't think I'm getting paid next week. And I think that's genuinely my last straw. They've done many terrible things. And when I officially leave that company I'm going to probably talk more and more about it uh, and my very poor interactions with it as it's quite a story with uh, this job however that's not the full point of why I'm doing this I'm doing this particular stream for myself I'm doing it to sort of de-stress and just focus on something that isn't terrible for a moment which is funny to say, I know, because I'm going to be playing Silent Hill, a notoriously scary game. And in fact, I'm playing an odd one of the series, Silent Hill 4. Silent Hill 4, yeah, they did not pay me. They, I, I have an app that lets me basically see my schedule and things like that, and because I have direct deposit, and it's a weekly paycheck, paycheck thing, Every Wednesday, I get to see how much I made, and then Thursday, they actually deliver the paycheck. I get to basically see it a day early. There is no paycheck. I'm not being paid. I'm not being paid at all. It's very terrible, and I'm tired of working for this company, as I said. However, I... I'm just gonna play this because this game means so much to me. It is easily my favorite Silent Hill even though it's not one of the best. It's not the worst by far. There are far worse games in the series and there are far worse games out there. But this game, especially its soundtrack, it just has resonated with me over time. And so through this dark time, I invite you to join me through sort of a memory lane with one of my most favorite games of all time as I see about moving past this terrible, terrible experience. So without further ado, let me get this game running. It's going to be a little strange. Um, this is one of the few Silent Hill games that actually has a proper PC port. Um, and in fact, I own said PC port. It, uh, it, you can actually pick it up on GOG. It's, you know, it's like 20 bucks. It's well worth the money. Um, this is my favorite Silent Hill game. Silent Hill for the room. Uh, this music. <laughs> Sadly, this music is loud. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Weird controls, very weird. I'm controls. sorry your job is so crappy. Yeah, yeah, it's it's really terrible. Also, hi. What's up, Rando? As I said, I'll talk more about that in a dedicated video about it. Like I'll I'll do a dedicated stream. I've been meaning to. Um It's just something that is what it is, and there's no way they're ever going to change about it. Uh, I kind of want to change the controls when I think about it. 
Let's see here. Move forward. That's all fine. It's different controls that I want to change. Button config. Here we go. Uh, oops. Oh, that's really weird. Oh, that's really weird. They remapped this in a very strange way. A good idea. To select things, I had to press square. To back out of things, I have to press X. That's really weird. Okay. I want my cancel button to be this one. My action button to be this one. Who do I need to cripple for you? <laughs> Who do you need to LOL. cripple for me? Uh, no one. I, I have my own things. Essentially, um, tomorrow or sometime this weekend, I'm going to be uh, going to the, the, the store that I work at to make sure that I get some form of payment, however that may be. Okay, so I think... It wants... Okay, okay here we go. That, there we go, now the game's controlling better. Okay, that was weird. We're gonna do this on normal. Oh my god, this fucking music. Like, I know I was just listening to it, but I love it. It was two years ago that Henry Towns had moved into room 302 of South Asheville Heights, an apartment building in the medium-sized city of Asheville. Henry was happy and enjoying his new life. I love the fucking premise of this horror game. But five days ago, something strange happened. He began to have a reoccurring nightmare each night. One other thing. He couldn't leave room 302. See if the controls work. Yeah, the controls seem to work. Did I miss the rest of Silent Hill 2? No. Was on vacation. Uh, no, actually. We're going to be picking that up tomorrow. Um, we have had less availability for playing Silent Hill 2 because it's more so based on Snoo schedule than mine. Uh, and Snoo typically works uh, the weekdays. They have Thursday off. Just during that particular instance, uh, they actually had some time beforehand. Uh, their own vacation time, so they were able to join me. Ah! Generic screen, stock screen. All right, let's see here. It's covered in blood and rust. Everything is bad here. This is my room, but what the hell happened to it? This room, is it really my room? More jam. More jam. More jam everywhere. There's a face in a wall. Let's see here, can we get out of this room? Uh, it's in terrible shape. The air is heavy. My head hurts. Oh, I can adjust the camera. Oh, that's weird. Oh, that's really fucking weird. Left and right are up and down, and up and down are left and right. Why is it, like, double inverted? Every horror game wastes jam. Every horror game wastes jam. I don't feel like washing my hands right now. I don't blame you. It's in the fridge. Are we gonna know? What's in the fridge, Henry? It smells horrible. I'm afraid to open it. Ugh. Gross. The TV's on. I love peach jam. Peach jam is delicious. Uh, apple jam is also really good. Where did this big TV come from? I thought I had a record player here. I don't even know what this is. Oh. Who is this guy? I get it now. I get it. Funny enough, I never put this together as a child. Uh, I'm not going to spoil what's going on. Creepy. It looks like a face. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Everything's getting fuzzy. 
Oh shit. The evil! No! Yeah, that's never a good sign when something starts growing out of the walls. Uh oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. There's a whole ass dude in there. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! You're gonna have to pay for the damage, sir. Sir! Sir, that was a fine wall! Oh, this fucking song. This is a sad fucking song. But, God, I love it. Oh no! My finger brushed on my mouse and it skipped it! Oh well, that's fine. We will hear that song later. There's our boy. Oh, man. Oh, man. What a dream. <laughs> Money don't grow on trees, bitch. You better for that wall. You better. You better be good for the cheddar. Uh, there's a phone. Hello? Hello, two five 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 two four nine five. It's still not working. Oh, the phone is ringing. How mysterious. Hello? Help me. What? The cord's cut. Spooky. Okay then. This is a photo of the church I ran across while visiting Silent Hill. For some reason, I was really attracted by the way it looked, so I took a, the picture. It's a brand new scrapbook. I can view it by going and pressing start. I still haven't gotten anything for the scrapbook. It's basically like my journal. This is a quick shot I took in downtown Silent Hill. It's a nice tourist town about half a day's drive from here. They actually mention this place uh, in Silent Hill 2. This is my bed. Ooh. There appears to be a woman we are focusing on. Really low poly. Really low poly. My goodness. She made out of Lego bricks. Down she go. I wonder what the significance of that is. Especially since the game forced my vision out the window. Now I can use this to look around all I want. Oh god, that is awful. Uh, I might have to change that. 555-3750. Hmm? Five, 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 Let's try it. That was just, what was that? Good fucking question! I don't know. It's evil. 
This is not trust. What did I miss? <laughs> was talking to my boo thang. Ah, uh, I'm trapped in a room. I call the phone number on a phone that's cord is cut. There's a piece of paper sticking out from behind this bookshelf. Oh, this chest could hold a lot of stuff. It's bringing my attention that I can store things inside this chest. Cool, cool. But there's a piece of paper here. It looks like a scrap from some book. Man, this thing looks like it was written. I think he ago. didn't pay the goddamn taxes. He did not. Through the ritual of the Holy Assumption, he built a world. It exists in a space separate from the world of our Lord. More accurately, it is within, yet without the Lord's world. Unlike the world of our Lord, yep, it is a world do it. extreme flux. Unexpected doors or walls, moving floors, odd creatures. A world only he can control. Anyone swallowed up by that world will live there for an eternity, undying. They will haunt that realm as a spirit. How can our Lord forgive Amen. such an abomination? I don't know. It is important to travel lightly in that world. He who carries too heavy a burden will regret it. All right, that's been added to the scrapbook. And next, we'll be taking a look at the weather. Tonight, we can expect scattered clouds clearing by morning. Tomorrow looks to be quite a nice day with a warm and sunny weather. Save point. I'm sure, we'll save the game. We'll just do a quick save. Continuing through the evening and the weekend, we can expect more of the same. So I Clock stopped working a few days ago. And uh, enjoy your weekend. It's weird. A few days ago, the power to my TV and VCR just cut out. Ever since I started having those weird nightmares. That's fucked. That's fucked. Five decades ago. That's when I've had the first nightmare. I haven't been able to get out of my room since then. The phone doesn't work, the TV doesn't work, I can't even get anyone to hear me when I yell. Oh hell no. Nah. My whole world has suddenly turned insane. My door's chained up and the windows... So I insane. accidentally <sighs> left my $400 headphones at the hotel I oh, stayed no! at. Oh no! Someone chained the door from the inside. How am I gonna get out of here? That sucks, dude! Oh my god! Don't go out. No. What the hell? Oh my god! What's going on here? I, I hope you're able to like get in contact with the hotel and get that sorted out. That's Eileen Galvin from next door. Oh man. I hope my luck changes before the party. Party. It's a bunch of weird handprints on the other side of the door. The fuck was that? Yeah, what was that? Uh We called them and conveniently they didn't find anything. Ah, uh, conveniently. That sucks. I'm so sorry, dude. There's a hole in my bathroom. This is not usually a good thing. What? Agreed. What the hell? S somebody in there? God, this guy, this game's audio just like fluctuates from being super loud to super quiet. Way. I mean, we can't go out any other way. The door, the windows are all sealed shut. The door is chained from the inside, and there's whispering. The sewage pipe's broken too. I want it? Yeah. Cool. I got a steel pipe. Does that sound like a kid to you guys? It sounds like a kid to me. Enter the hole? Sure. I have nothing better to do. Let's climb in. You know what else I did on vacation? Went into the ocean with my phone in my pocket. No! Totally fried it. Rando, no! I'm so sorry. Oh my god, this vacation sounds like it's been rough. Did you have fun at least? I hope you had fun. Oh dear. What a long ass tunnel. Claustrophobic, very much. 
And also, what a strange. I'm a ducking thing. dumb shit. <laughs> oh, you gotta check your pockets for those things before you go swimming. I hope I hope you're able to get that replaced fairly easy. Coming through the hole, we appear to be on an escalator. Going down. Lots of pipes. Lots of weirdness. Henry here seems... I got an upgrade though to the S21 Plus. I love it. Hey, that's a positive light on that. That's fantastic. I don't know what kind of phone I have. I, I don't really think about it. Alright. Nothing back here. Up for lore discussion? For lore discussion? Ah, uh, depends. There are people in here that I don't think have ever played these. And while I've played the entire series, like, don't want to spoil things for people. Especially since tomorrow I'm continuing and maybe finishing Silent Hill 2 with someone who's never played it. Door shut tight. Door's locked from the other side. There's nothing I can get from that. Hmm. However, there's that lady we saw. Do not run from the Lord. Do not run. Who are you? Who am I? Who are you? What's your name? Henry. Amen. And you? <laughs> Amen. <laughs> this is my dream, and you don't even know my name. It's Cynthia. Oh. Your dream. That's right. <laughs> this is just a dream. <laughs> And a really terrible one, too. I hope I wake up soon. So you think this is a dream, huh? Well, if it's not a dream, what I is I love it? that meme. Anyway, <laughs> I want to get out of here, but I can't find the exit. <coughs> Say, will you help me find it? Will you? Sorry, but I gotta do I'm this. kind of scared, <laughs> okay. you know? I, I hope it's not too Special big of spoilers. Mad I Kurtz. <laughs> Mad I Kurtz. It's just a dream, so I might as well have some fun. Mad I Kurtz. Let's see here. How do I pull this out? Nope. Close enough. Oh, you gotta see what the TDS would do. How do I equip my weapon? Oh boy, the controllers, the controls on this are very borked. All right, to the options. Let's do this again. Oops. Okay. Let's see here. There's a ready weapon and stuff like that. What about use and equip? There is no use and equip item. Oh my god. Okay, what if I want it to be egg? Okay. Think that should be fine. Yes. Move that over there. Hopefully that should disappear any second now. Oh boy. I'm glad this has a PC port, but boy does it need a lot of fixing. Matacurts. Medic house. Medidath. Bathroom. Wait a minute. Uh huh. I just flipped my art. Oh god, it looks like shit. WTF. Uh, I think I'm gonna no. puke. I know those feels. Well, did you do the like reverse flip or did you rotate it? I'm sure it looks great. Just like you. Aww. 
I agree, though. I'm sure it looks great, Nap. I didn't know you drew, though. If You should totally share your stuff. I love seeing people's art. No matter what it is. Hi. Lol. Alright. The mail is going. Oh, shit. I'll never understand why these dogs sound like jaguars. Hell no. Time oh. to GTFO. Oh no. Oh no. Guys, I can't swing my weapon! I. Good Why lord. Why are they shaking like that? Why are they shaking like that? I can't swing my weapon. Why can't I swing my weapon? There's ready weapon. Action investigate got changed. Okay. I'll make it this then. They built different. Run, boy, run. Okay. Here we go. Hit. Ah! Okay. Yeah. Come on, get him. Stomp! We got another dog to dispatch. No, you don't. I'm on you. Stop! Something got knocked over. Looks like there's no one in here. Somebody knocked something over in there. So, hey, uh, Cynthia? Cynthia, you alright? I don't think anyone's in here. Cynthia? There's a big fucking hole here. Get this crazy hole lead to. Enter the hole? Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, this these controls are borked. I'll have to make two. So that's the loop of the game. Is it essentially Oh, there goes my phone. Notifications from something. I see. A friend of mine is sending me uh, a TikTok video. I'll have to what? Check that out later. Another dream. What a weird dream. But it seems so real. Yes, with vampire tongue it. dogs. Very real. Was I really inside that woman's dream? That's a good question. Oh, that's just stupid. What am I thinking? This is why we don't do drugs. This is exactly why we don't do drugs. Anyways. Maybe this is exactly why we do drugs, Nep. Don't you want to go into someone else's dream? Let's see if anything's changed out here. Go eat drugs. Go eat drugs. There's a piece of paper. What's this? Mum, why don't you wake up? Strange. Anything going on in the hallway? Doesn't look like it. The 
furniture. It's been here since I moved in. Huh? That's weird. Somebody moved it. Do you know Matt Sturbate? I think he did a voice here. <laughs> Matt Sturbate? Wow! Who could have done it? Uh, there's a gun. Will you take the pistol? Yeah, I'll take the pistol. Oh, I have a handgun with ten bullets. There's a message carved in here. It looks like they used an ice pick or something. The faint hope I Little have Timmy took too much of Daddy's secret sugar. Oh no. I've somehow managed to tunnel this far, but no matter what I do, I can't get any further. The hallways, the windows, the walls. It feels like this room is stuck in another dimension. Eileen never noticed. Eileen? Casual leaves your handgun laying around. Yep, casually leaves it underneath a dresser. There's a peek hole. Oh, this is creepy. Hmm. Where did I put that damn broom? Uh, right in front of us. Oh. Eileen is right over here. Oh yeah, this is creepy. Who's calling me at this hour? On a phone that doesn't work. Where did you go? Cindy. Hurry! Save me! If you need a token, there's one here! Well, I feel dirty now. Oh, she's sweeping up her mess. Well, that's nice. She's, uh, she's thoughtful, at least. Like, she's not one of those people who just makes a mess and then leaves it and then like, oh, well. All right. Into the hole. We go in and... This hole seems bigger than before. There's a hole here, and it's not gone now. Woo. We uh, coming in. Hi. Some kind or of she's sweeping there. up the body parts. It's got a coin in its hand. You take the coin, yeah, I'll take the coin. Lynch Street line coin. Okay. The dogs are still here, and the dogs are still dead. Good, though. Some bad noises. That would be a waste of food. Be a waste of food. Um. Ooh! Oh, no. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh, they fast. Oh, they spaced! Ah! Uh. That's why she's sweeping. Yep. Gotta collect it all up. It. Uh. Stop! Whew. Okay, I think. This is not the way we came from. I'm fast AF boy. What the fuck? What the hell is that? We got some dogs up ahead. Peter wants to know your location. Peter wants to know my location. I want to know my location too. I'm somewhere on Silent Hill, wherever that is. Just a heavy smash and then the stomp. Hello, dog. The dog seems to have been offended that I smacked him on his fucking snoot. Ah! He took offense to that. Ah, oh, too soon. Oh crap. Oh crap. 
bash him. Hey. This dog, he knows every martial art. All of them. Ouch. Get your dog! I think it's dead dead. Oh, now I made sure it's dead dead. Okay, that door is shut tight and won't open at all. The hell is this thing? It looks like a giant worm of some kind. What's this? Peace to hold it. Absolutely. Smack it. Smack it? Smack. Smack? Alright, in a second. We will we will smack. I should be able to get to the street this way, but it's a dead end. Let's see what happened when I smick. Smick it a worm. Uh I've got a giant worm of some kind. <laughs> you got a giant worm of some kind? <laughs> Does it also dig holes? I don't think we can kill that worm. He's too big. Need bigger pipe. So I think I see where we got the phone call. Let's see here. Name it Here's Sally. Line entrance. I can't use this here, apparently. I can't use this here, apparently. Isn't this the entrance? Isn't this no, it mostly lies dormant. Lies dormant, I see. How do I do this again? Ah, here it is. I can't use this. Sorry, what are you talking about? This is where I use this. I apparently had to use it on the actual turnstile, not on the uh, little coin slot. All right. Oh no, it's the man from the wall. He's still doing it. Sir, this is public property. It doesn't mean you own it. So, oh no, there's two of them. Ow. So the deal with these guys, I can't kill them. I can fight them as much as I want, but I cannot kill them. Shit, dead end. And them being in my presence causes me damage, so I need to fucking run. Oh, dead end. You need your samurai sword. Cynthia. Eighteen. It has eighteen on it. Okay. All right, I'll find a way. That door is shut tight. Okay, can't use that. I need samurai sword. I knew being a weeb would come in handy. Yes. I'll find a way, Cynthia. Don't you worry. The door's locked from the other side. Shit. I can get in here, though. Oops. That takes me right back where I was. Door shut tight and won't open at all. Ew. Why is it all squipshy? There's a button here. We push it? Uh, yeah, I'll push the button. Looks like the car's door's open. <gasps> that means we can get to Cynthia! Cynthia! We're coming to help! Sweet. Uh oh! Let's get on the train. Oh, it's all squishy. Why is it all squishy? Ah, oh, gross. I can't do anything about that. 
That's closed, so I can't go that way. Uh oh. That's a bad noise. Uh. We should probably get moving. Before the ghosts get us. Oh no. Run, Cynthia, run! Oh! Okay, we're in here. Have you ever thought, am I as good of a person as our dogs think we are? A few times. There's a box here that has 1008 written on it. It's locked and I can't open it. What the hell? Looks like mannequin parts just hanging out here. Oh cool, we're on the other side of this. But my head hurts. That means we're in the presence of a demon. Ah! Grandma! No! no well, I, I don't know, BC, he's dead. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, your puppy is gone. Big sad. Big sad. Very big sad. That door is shut tight and we'll go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Let's get the fuck out of here, Cynthia. Shut tight. I think I've gone backwards. I can't be certain, but I think I went backwards. There is one way to tell. No, I have not. I'm on the right side, which is the opposite side. Sweet. We got true! Hey, where'd she go? Cynthia? 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 Oh no, did the ghosties get her? Cynthia! Will I enter the hall? Yes, we will enter the hall. We will go through the hall and see what's going on. Let's see, has anything changed over here? Doesn't seem like Are it. you going for a specific ending? Me? Yes. I might be. But uh, none of these options that I'm doing here are going to influence the endings. Technically speaking, I can't really change the ending until uh, I get closer to the end of the game, actually. Let's see nothing in here I thought you were nothing going on out here but yeah I have one in mind I typically have one in mind at least if I know there's multiple endings so one of the nice things about coming back here is that I'm able to heal my wounds coming back to this place so frequently taking uh, trips back home to rest, essentially. Very good idea. Very helpful. I thought it had similar conditions as SH2. Uh, actually, no. 80% of my pics in my phone and on my computer are pics of frogs. Nice. Frogs. Frog. Frog. Uh, no, actually. Uh, the way that this one does endings and stuff like that is kind of hastily put together if I'm being honest. Frog. Frog. We have a limited number of inventory. Hey, that door is unlocked. Oh, puts me over here. I don't want to be over here. Mine are dogs. Uh, I don't really have any photos on my phone. I don't take pictures and I don't really save anything. Uh. 
Uh oh. Nana! What? Wait. I was being turned around. Nana, no! I don't want to smooch. Duck! Where you go? Where you go? He's not there. Oh! Come at me. So, fun fact about this particular Silent Hill. Ah, damn it. Uh, this one was actually supposed to be a different game entirely. Uh, which is why it has, uh, the combat system it does. Ow. Damn, this one dog's fucking me up. He's in the corner. He's screwed. He can't beat my ma my moves at that point. My dogs are my life. Oh my god. They are hella spoiled. The worm is back. Henry, I found the exit. Come to the turnstile. Henry, I found the exit. Come to the turnstile. Oh. That doesn't sound good. Okay. Ah, uh, fair warning on this part. This part sucks. This part is awful. Genuinely. Genuinely. This part is the fucking worst. This part is the goddamn worst. I'm on the wrong side. Let's go on the right side. Let's go up. These goddamn wall monsters are seriously the worst. I don't have to kill them. I just have to be prepared for their shenanigans. Because they can bitch slap you like none other. Go. This part, I think, is the part. Ah! As I said, it was just a bitch stuff. Oh. Ah! I've fallen and I can't get up. Try it! Beep six gasp, beep six gasp. Do you imagine getting thrown down an escalator? Ah! Ah! As I said, this part sucks! This part is the worst. And whoever designed it is a terrible person. You just jump with the swinging! Hey! Swinging arm! Being stinky! Okay, this is actually the worst part. Because I have to deal with. Take my giant stick. Okay, I think I just got one more to deal with. So long as I can hit them, I can keep them at bay. It's just hitting them is the problem. Got any more? No, we reached the end. We fucking did it. Ugh. Oh hey, it's the other end of uh this this part. Which means we can get these boules! Yes, I would like to take the boule. Sweet. We can get all that ammo we have. Oh no. Oh no. No, sir, I'm low on health, please. Not like this. Uh oh. Women's makeup items are scattered on the ground. They must be Cynthia's. Uh oh. Uh oh. There's a plate on the door. Remove the plate. Temptation plate card. Cynthia? Oh no. Are 
Are you okay? <laughs> Are you all right? It's just a dream, right? I think I drank too much last night. I never got to do that special favor for you. I I feel like I'm dying. Sees all the jam, are you all right? <laughs> Just a really sloppy jam eater. Got really lost in the sauce. I'm not actually crying, like, like, the sniffles were me actually laughing. And that's terrible to be doing right now at this scene, because this is an emotional scene. Especially with that song. God, that fucking song. Room of Angel is a beautiful song. Um, but I remembered something, actually, and I'll, I'll share it with it, uh, share what I, I'm thinking of in a second. Okay. I'm just looking for a good opportunity. Like, when I say that my knowledge of the Silent Hill series is deep, it's very, very deep. Cynthia. I know too much. Uh-oh. Man, what's that noise? Everybody? Motherfucker wasted all that jam. All that jam has gone to waste. So messy. I can forgive them, though. It was their last meal. Mystery abounds. Couldn't even pump up the jam. Couldn't even pump it up. Barely even tried. Okay. Can I have control again? Sweet. I'm gonna take a second. I'm gonna branch away from uh, the game here uh, to pull up something. Uh, so in a really wacky and ludicrous display, what if I told you that there is a song from Silent Hill that was in Dance Dance Revolution, and that Cynthia there is the lady in, uh, in the, in the fucking song. Give me a second. Here it is. Here it is. Uh, don't play. Please don't play. Okay. Oh, it's wanting to play. I stopped it. All right, let me get this pulled up over here. Let's turn this up a bit. This is real. This is real. This is fucking real. This is real. 
Uh huh. This is real. I cry this is in Dance Dance Revolution. This seems like a fever dream. <laughs> I think I took too much drugs. It's all the drugs. <laughs> oh, fuck. I don't know who thought this was a good idea. I'll admit, I like the remix. In fact, Your Rain is a very good song. Um, but, like, why? Why Silent Hill? I can't fucking believe this. Like, it seems like they tried to make her a bigger character than what she actually is, you know? Because she just dies. She shows up, flirts with your character a little bit, and then she dies. Huh? There are scraps from magazine articles, books, and things like that, but nothing useful. Hurry up and get that ambulance! Quit yapping and move her already. This is the type of stuff 13 year old Edge Lords listens to. <laughs> uh, that could be also true of most of the Silent Hill soundtrack, but God, I love it. Uh, I've got one of those 13 year old cringe stories actually involving this soundtrack. Oh, it's fucking funny. Oh, it's fucking funny. Um, so, let's see, I would have been in 7th grade or so, around that time. Um, and so in middle school, we had an art class. It was a dedicated art class. It was required and things like that, and I had fun in it. Uh, I didn't really learn too much about it because the lady who was teaching is kind of overbearing. And she At Rando, but there, guys, I'm so B-R-O-C-K-N. <laughs> I'm so broken. <laughs> uh, but anywho, one of the nice things about this particular uh, art class, though, was that the teacher allowed everybody to bring in their own music. And so a random kid every, like, uh, week would be able to play their own music and stuff like that. Ha 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 So when it came to be my time, because this game comes with its soundtrack when you buy it. And I was rocking out to that shit. All this evil music and things like that. Like, the real freaky shit. Uh, and the first track in that soundtrack is Room of Angels. So now imagine. Imagine that you are, you know, you're, you're in class. Oh, hey, hey, it's Mox's turn to, uh, to, to fucking play his, his CD for everybody today. I hope it's a good one. I hope it really gets the artistic juices flowing, all right? So you sit down, the CD gets popped in, and I'm sitting there, I'm drawing my happy little thing. I think I was drawing, like, uh, we were doing, like, this chart thing where you're drawing pictures that were in boxes to make a whole thing. And then this comes on. Plays My Little Pony. Basically. No. Oh God. <laughs> yeah. So this starts blaring from the little like CD player that they had. Satan and you. So yeah. Yes, my son. 
there was a meme here. It's gone now. Needless to say, Mox wasn't allowed to bring in his own music afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, joke, no joke. I I listened to this this entire series as soundtrack on the red. I hope so. And like at that particular time, that was the, uh, like the thing that I would loop was that per this particular soundtrack. Although the cult itself is gone, I'm sure the spirit of it is still alive. There are too many strange things happening in that town. I'm investigating two people, or maybe I should just say just one. I've just about discovered what's going on. April eighth. Hey, that's my birthday. Scars all the 13-year-olds. Dude, everyone was like stopping what they were doing and just fucking staring at me when it happened. And I was just over there being like, I can't get this eyeball. I, it's just not right, like the right shape. Chucky Milk! Yes! A bottle of wine! Yes! Alright, now. Unlike... Almost all the other Silent Hills, you actually have a limited inventory space. Which is what this is for. And technically, this is also used to sort of work around some limitations in some things. Uh, so, I don't have a need for this. WTF is wrong with this kid. I don't have anything with this. <laughs> right? I actually technically don't need this. The broken... The bottle is an interesting weapon. It's really terrible at first, but when you break it over somebody, it actually gets a whole lot better. But all in all, it's not necessarily worth the effort. The pipe is a whole lot better to just walk around with. Uh, it sounds like... They're still cleaning. Oh, hey. It's the superintendent. He's doing some cleaning himself. All right. Let's see how Eileen's doing. Eileen? Yay? Oh, I see the uh, sirens have gotten her attention. There's something wrong with that bunny. Alright, let's save real fast. We almost died there. And I wanted to overwrite that. Thank you very much. Alright, let's go see how the hole's doing. Hold up. Is it just me? Or does this seem a little... Yeah, one of the locks came undone. Hmm. Interesting. Did the hole get bigger? Into the hole. Let's see what's on the other side! No, yeah, I, I occasionally love to think about that particular moment. In, in history and go, what the fuck was wrong with me? I should have kept my weirdness to myself, but hey, here I am. I'm out on full display with my weirdness now. Get weird. Have fun with it. Don't give a fuck what anyone says, you know? So now we're in a forest. Of some kind. Looks like uh, there's a river or something next to us. There's a well. It's too dark to see. This writing, what does it mean? It's kind of written all over a tree stump. It's weird writing here, too. Very strange. Very, very strange. 
We got them dogs. Them doggies is back. We got a hole here, but I don't think there's any reason for us to go through right now. Okay, now we're in some kind of facility. Uh-oh. Uh, how confident am I feeling? I'm gonna have to. Ah, uh, squibsh. 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 Hey, Squibsh. Ah, fuck these weird bat, like, mosquito things. Take the pistol bullet. Oops. Yes, I want to take the pistol bullet. I have so much ammo. And I don't know when I'm going to actually choose to use any of it. No! Yes, yeah, these things are just too much of a hassle to not fight. Stimpch. Tonk. Tonk. I like that the weapon makes noises when it collides with the wall. Ow! Got him, got him! One more! Most dangerous weapon in this game. The end of my heal. Squish all those fucking things. Now, like these th these monsters, as like the other Silent Hill games have representation and things like that. But I'll be frank. This has pretty much nothing to do with our protagonist here, actually. The engine's still running, the driver's side. The door is open. Interesting. It stopped with the brake pedal engaged. There's all sorts of things scattered on the seat. Amongst the trash is a scrap of paper with something written on it. It's been a while since I came here to Silent Hill. Maybe I'll meet the devil this time. But whenever I come to a cool place like Silent Hill, I always get real thirsty. Jasper Gunning. There's a memo pad in here, too. I'm not sure what that nosy guy meant when he said his home is the orphanage in the middle. The lake is northwest, so the opposite is southeast. That nosy guy said one other thing I don't understand. If you bring the dug up key, you can't go back. Put it somewhere before you return there. What a weird nosy guy. He's so nosy. Oh, uh, hi. Too. Rock is creepy somehow. There, there was a Fun fact, guy, yeah. this girl who came at like 7 p.m. came to ask the art teacher for some colored paper. At 7 p.m. the whole year she kept telling me the art teacher hates me for no reason. Mother stone. Mother. They're just uh, uh, up, up ahead in that, that weird building. Op operating some kind of crazy re religious cult. They, they used, used to c c collect orphans and, and, and d d did things to them. Did things to them. That's fucked up. Kind of gives you the chill chills, huh? How strange. So, this is another mention of orphans. Uh-oh. It's them dogs! Uh-oh! Ah! Oh! It's more dogs! Welcome... 
Silent Hill Smile Support Society Wish House. This is the orphanage run by the cult, huh? What a depressing looking orphanage. It's called the Wish House, jeez. Alright. Will I be entered the hole? Yeah, we will enter the hole. We need to heal. We got a little messed up. I wonder why she wanted colored paper. Yo, 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 hold up. What's going on here? I am exploding. I have many messages. What's going on here? My art teacher had huge bobs and all my hormone addled brain could focus on was them. <laughs> I hated art class to say the least. Jeepers. I see. I'm uh, getting messages about important life stuff. All right. Cool. So you have one of those teachers with the big bob. Not really their fault. People don't get to decide that kind of stuff. Uh, hello. going on in this room what do you mean uh oh i heard weird noises coming from inside there help hey richard can you see anything from your window no everything looks pretty normal to me the guy who lives here what's he like anyway i know his name and face but that's about it well I'm gonna go call the super. Yeah, good idea. Shit, damn it. They can't hear me. Help. I'm trapped. Help. I can't leave. Okay, let's go in the creepy hole. We got our heels done. I'm stuck step bro. <laughs> stuck step bro. <laughs> I guess in this case it'd be more like I'm stuck step sis. There's more writing. I can't read this. It's locked. Everything's locked. It's all locked. Ooh, a lot of blood. And I hear more dogs. Ah! He got an axe! The fuck was that noise? Child. I know how to solve this one. I know what to do. I, I know what to do. He's immortal. A child. A child. Drop hey, kick it. Little boy. What are you doing here? Isn't this an orphanage? You're... Finally the third revelation. What? Something's gonna happen. That nosy guy that was here, he said it too. Something big is gonna happen. Finally, it's gonna happen! <laughs> that guy's all whacked out. Alright. 
What a weird looking door. It's locked from the outside. I can't get it open. I want to remember that door. What's going on here? The graves been dug here. At the bottom of the coffin are numbers 11121. So we've seen 16121 and now 11121. The stuff scattered on the ground from the other side of the fence like something was thrown away from over there. Weird. And I still can't read any of that jazz. There's nothing really here. So I guess we leave. Oh, right, that ghost! Okay, I guess we go back to the house and see about other routes. Because that one clearly didn't quite work out. So we got a door over there. Oh, hey, what's his face? You still all freaked out? The, the d d door won't open. That nosy guy g g gave me something really good. I, I, I c could let you have it, but, 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 but not for free. Not for free? I'm really thirsty. Uh Here, take my chalky milk. Awesome. Here, take this. He just There's threw it on the ground. Written on it. What a dickhead. Alright. There's a small spade with a bloody inscription. Will you take it? Yeah. A blood inscribed braid. Written on the on the blood is opposite where the lake and house meet. Outside the hand holding onto the ground. I wonder what that could mean. Ah, uh, dogs! And skaters! Dogs and skaters! Ah, uh, get off my leg! Ah! Uh -huh. Dogses. Dogses. Ah! It's just been skeeters. I can handle it. I've got full hick again. I don't know why. What's this? What could it be used for? I don't know. Squish. Something. Smack. Metal and heavy is creaking really bad in here. And that is a bad sound to hear. Come on. Get him. Ah! No, he got my head. Snick. Got it, got it. Motherfucker. Hold up, that's a dude. There's a dude hanging up, up here. Holy shit. There's a dead guy. What the fuck? Oh shit. It's Toluca Lake. We're in Silent Hill. We are actually in Silent Hill. There's no fog, but here we are. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Do I want this portable med kit? Are you kidding me? Of course I want the portable med kit. Broken statues and weird writing all over the place. There's weird writing here too. Ah, uh, we could probably go enter the hole. Our inventory is full of bullets right now. So we can put some away to conserve on space. Alternatively, I could really start using my gun, but I don't want to run out of ammo in case I need it. You feel me?
Nothing. It ain't nothing. Alright. Oops. Shit. Let's put away this one, we'll put away this one. So we got 20 bullets stashed away. Perfectly fine. Alright. Back in we go. Get out of the hole? Yes. Uh, people are asking me questions I can't answer right now because I'm streaming. Holds up step ladder. This is my step ladder. I never knew my real ladder. I never knew my real ladder. The ladder went out for cigarettes. I never came back. Alright, so there's the lake. So opposite corner of the lake is that door we didn't go through. What's this? It's nothing. Looks like a raw iron ingot just hanging out there. Oh my god! Ow! Oh dear. He wanted to get some milk. He wanted to get some milk. You want some milk? What's over here? It's a weird looking tree. What the fuck was that? Oh, it's the hands. Uh, where's it? The, didn't the spade mention these hands? I was coming up from the ground. Oh man, thank god it's just a tree root. I guess we dig up here. He had nobody to hold him up. No one. Everybody just walked on him. A rusted bloody key. Hold this key will wander for eternity. Mm. So this is one of those fun little traps because technically, while you have that key in your inventory, you can only move about one or two rooms uh, adjacent to where you get the key before you end up looping forever. Hey. Golf club. It's a golf club. Looks like a six iron. Will I take the golf club? Yeah, I'll take a golf club. It's better than my pipe. However, it has durability. Will I enter the hole? Yeah, I'll enter the hole have to enter the hole because I can't leave with this key but I can however put the key inside of my uh, storage chest storage tote and I'll be able to then pick it up uh, when I'm back at the church let's see here away. Fantastic. Let's look around, see if anything's really changed. Got some people hanging out in their apartments and stuff. Some old lady just kind of looking out the window. Restaurant in the distance. Restaurant Fuzzy, Hotel South Ashford bar. Nothing really too crazy. It's weird looking buildings. Very strange. How's Eileen doing? Eileen isn't in right now. If I remember correctly, they were going to go get the superintendent. Oh! Uh, hi! You 
Yeah. Uh, can I help you? Dude, your tie is weird. Alright. Oh my god, I'm getting so many notifications on Discord right now. I had nine plus previously, now I'm back up to seven. During this whole travel, I might have to take a peek, see what's going on. Strange danger, bad touch. Bad touch. Oh no, bad touch! He's a ghost, he's got a knife it looks like. That's probably not good. There's that fucking noise again. And bandage wrapped trees. Bloody bandage wrapped trees. Oh no, the tree cut itself and somebody had to put the band-aid on it. Oh look at all these hurt trees! Ah! Ah, my ass! Let me go! Hold on a second, weirdo. If you had 2k to spend on something frivolous, what would it be? 2k to spend on something frivolous. Uh, honestly? I'd probably see about picking up some very expensive games from my past. So I could experience them again. Like, I, I, when I got my tax return this year, uh, not knowing how things were going to go, I picked up a Sega Saturn and a bunch of games for it, and it cost me almost a thousand bucks just to do that. So I'd probably do something similar, and I'd probably end up getting only, like, one or two games or so. But yeah, I'd love to be able to experience some other stuff from the, the old past. Hey. Where's, it's another, isn't it? Yeah, it's another. Give me the key. Alright. Out we go. Into the hole? Yes, we're gonna enter the hole. That's all we do, is we just enter and exit holes. Oh. Oh. I opened the door. Can I say anything about that? You found it, huh? Okay. Oh my god, this place is a fucking wreck. It still has electricity for some reason, though. Some candelabras, some paper. The paper selling part, I can't even read most of the pages. Here's the part I can read. It's the second sign, and God said, Offer the blood of the ten sinners and the white oil. But be then released from the bonds of the flesh and gain the power of heaven. From the darkness and void, bring forth gloom. And gird thyself with despair for the giver of wisdom. The third sign, and God said, Return to the source through sin's temptation under the watchful eye of the demon. Wander alone in the formless chaos. Only then will the fourth atone and be in alignment. Weird. Uh, we're gonna take a second and we're gonna ignore that. Never mind, I guess there's nothing else to look at. There's a plate on the door. Will you remove the plate? Yeah. What's on the plate? <laughs> Holy shit, dude. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. My guy. Oh no! I finally met him! 
the one the nosy guy talked about. The devil! Jesus Christ. A special news report. In a forest near Silent Hill, the burned corpse of a 30-year-old male was discovered earlier today. The police have ruled it a homicide and are investigating. The numbers 17121 were reportedly carved into the man's body. Due to the marks on the victim, the police are investigating possible links to the Walter Sullivan case 10 years ago. Walter Sullivan. That name is also from Silent Hill 2. Another locked on. This is the superintendent. Are you in there, Henry? Help me! There's something wrong with this room! Help! Let me out of here! Is anybody home? What's going on here? Let me out! <laughs> something in there. Yeah. That sound. It's the same one as back then. Back then? What does he mean by back then? There are more handprints on that wall than there were before. Oh, this camera control is awkward. Let's see here. Hey, Eileen. You all right? You look like you're looking right at me. They just, they just vibin'. They do be vibin'. Alright. Scratch me back. Cause back was itchy. Okay. It was like I thought the power was blowing out. And now the news. Yesterday, Wally the walrus, a longtime resident of the Springfield Zoo, gave birth to a healthy baby walrus pup named Buttercup. No. Mother and child are doing just fine. No. Oh, hey, I think that's Richard right there. Is he looking at us? Uh, that lady down there is looking at us. Weird. All right, let's go look at the hole. It's gotten even bigger. It's taking up almost all of the mirror now. The hole's changing again, and I think I can hear children's voices. Will I go in? Yeah, let's go in. So why not? Why not?
Uh, <sighs> this level. One of the best and worst in this entire fucking game. That sounds like the next person who's going to die on us. The door... or the lock is broken. We can go in here, though. Take the pistol bullets? Sure. What the fuck is that thing? Graffiti, it looks like it's kids writing. I'm being watched from the middle room. Scrap of paper. Lucky! I finally escaped from the cell. I decided to take a careful look around the building. The scariest place was the first floor basement. There's a kitchen in the northeast. Uh, but next door in the northwest is a death chamber. To get in there, you have to punch in the right numbers. I don't know the numbers, and it was too dark to even see the panel, so I didn't go in. He's gonna kill me! Walter's gonna kill me! Sorry, sir, your door's locked. I can't help you. He's gonna kill me! Alright, so we have ourselves another hole, and what appears to be a memo. Sloppily written note. To get to the surveillance room in the middle of the complex, you have to use the corpse disposal chutes in the cells. However, on the first and second floors, these cells are locked, so th that's so the kids wouldn't discover them. If you have to get to the first floor from one of those cells on the third floor, uh, I know how to do it, but it's really a pain. Also, the lights only work on the third floor. Okay, so we have to go and use the third floor. If we want to get down to the first floor. Oh no! The wall monsters are back. These are not ones that I'm going to be able to just let live. Just gonna have to beat on them until they're dead. He's dead. That little wobbly he made is, is the sign that he's done. Ah! Suck it! Yeah! Yeah. Done. There's another one dead. Oh no, you don't. What the hell is that? Genuinely not sure what that noise was. Ah, that. Yeah. So a Saint Medallion is going to be useful, but it's not going to be useful for us right now. What the fuck is that noise? Also, did I just pass a door? No, 
I didn't. It just looked weird. Alright, so we have bright light in here. Everything in this place is jacked up a little bit. Yeah. Of this, it's a key. Take the key. Yeah, I want the key. Water prison exit key. Fuck these things. There's a hole here. My inventory is full. Let's go through the hole. Here, put some stuff away. I uh, don't need to hold on to that. Don't need to hold on to that. Don't need to hold on to that. And that freed up a lot of space. Doing a lot better. It's a scrap of paper stuck under here. Lately, I've been feeling like my life is in serious danger. I've been through a lot in my life, but I've never felt this kind of pure animal fear. In case something happens to me, I've decided to write it down what I've learned to so for whoever you are that's living in the apartment now. I've been investigating the mass murder which took place seven years ago in which ten people were killed in ten days. They were killed in a variety of ways, but the one thing they had in common is that each corpse had the following numbers uh, in order of their deaths carved into them. 11121, 02121, 03, 02, 04, 02, 05, 06, 07, 08, 09, and 010. Or not 010, just 10. The name of their killer was carved in as well. His name was Walter Sullivan, April 4th. Strange. Is the person who put that in there still out here? Eileen's fighting off some bugs. Weird. We're gonna save the game. All right, all right. So I think I've actually had my fill for this today. I wasn't even going to really stream because of like emotions and things like that. Uh, so I appreciate everybody who came out for this tonight. I know things are a little bit shorter than they usually are, but that's just kind of how I'm feeling right now. Uh, I am tired. I'm stressed. And I, I should probably eat something. I haven't eaten or drank anything today. I should probably do something about that. After all, it is 4 p.m. where I am. Uh, so I hope everybody enjoyed themselves, stays hydrated, and remembers to wash their hands. I'm Mr. Mox, and I hope you have a wonderful evening. Bye-bye.